Hello, viewers. You're welcome to another exciting problem on this page. Wow, we have a quadratic equation with a factorial function. I know you know how to do this problem, so I want to see your comments right in the comment section now. Okay, so let us go into this problem and see what we know how to do. All right, now the first thing I would like us to do here is to take these guys down to this side. So we have x squared plus 19x is equal to x factorial. You know what factorial is, right? You know that factorial, if you have four factorial, you have four times three times two times one. So you're, re you're, re you're reducing these integers by one by one until you get to one. So x factorial would be something like uh, x into x minus one, right? Factorial, because you see continue. What I mean is that when you have four factorial, you can decide to say this is four times three factorial because three factorial, you're still going back to this way. So you can decide to stop here with the factorial um, um, sign because I've not exhausted all of these factorials. So now I can have here x squared uh, plus 19x. All right, so now the, the next thing I want to do for this problem, we are given the condition that x is positive. Please take note. We give it the condition that x is positive. So because of this condition, I can divide everybody by x. I'll divide here by x and I'll divide here by x. So now we have x plus 19 is equal to x minus 1 factorial, right? Now, the next thing you want to do, you can now bring in the power of substitution. So you want to substitute right now. So we can say let, uh, let uh, p be equal to x minus 1. So, and that means um, p plus 1 will be equal to x, right? So here becomes p plus 1 right? Uh -huh. And here becomes plus 19 equal to, here becomes P factorial. And uh, P, 1 plus 19 is going to give me, uh, that will be P plus 20 equal to P factorial. All right, so at this point now, we begin to try numbers. We need to do uh, try and error. So we say let P be 1. When P is 1, when p is equal to 1, so you have 1 plus 21, that will give us 21 is equal to uh, 1 factorial. And that is not true. So that is wrong. So when p is equal to 2, uh, what do we have? We have uh, 2 plus um, 20, that will give us 22 is equal to 2 factorial is the same as 2 times 1, which is still uh, 2. So that is not still correct. So when p is 3, we still fail. So when you try when p is 4, when p is equal to 4, we have 4 plus 20 is equal to 4 factorial. And 4 factorial is 24, right? And here we have 24. So that means p must be equal to 4. And you know, we have to find this um, solution in form of x. So recall that, uh, recall that, P is equal to X minus one, right? So, okay, sorry, we call that, uh, we've gotten the value of uh, P to be four. So we plug it right here. So now we have P is equal to X minus one. So we have P is equal to um, X minus one. That will be four. Uh, sorry, so that should be four right here. Then we have X here minus one. And that will give me four plus one is equal to X. And finally, x is equal to 5. So that's the answer to this quadratic factorial equation. So if you love what we do, consider subscribing and share the video to other learners. I love you and I want to see you in the next class. Bye-bye.